Hey guys, this is Red, welcome back to a new Minecraft video. Christmas is just around the corner, today is the 5th and it will be in, our, in about 20 days. So I think that it's finally time to decorate a Christmas tree in Minecraft. As you can see, I'm in the building world here and I have this Christmas tree that I decorated uh, in another video that you can find right here using custom skulls. Now, this time we are going to decorate it in a better way because we are going to use particles as you saw from the thumbnail of the video. To get started, of course, you'll need to build a Christmas tree you can take inspiration from this one and make sure that it has these beads these blocks these leaves that are coming outside from the tree itself you can see that I have many of them for example this one this one this one here this one here and the reason why we are doing this is because you know glass panes if we place them adjacent to a block they connect to that block and I don't want this to happen I want them to stay like this just a really thin layer of glass like this one and the way to do this, just separate the glass from a block, don't uh, place it adjacent. And that's why we have all of these bits of the Christmas tree coming out, which I think that they don't even look bad, because, well, Christmas tree is made like, like this. It has these bits that are coming out, which is perfect for what we want to do. And, okay, so the materials that you need is just some colored stained glass panes and that's it. For this decoration I'm going to use red and green stained glass panes because they are the traditional Christmas colors and another thing that we need is two special armor stands that you can find in the video description. There's a link if you click it you'll be forwarded to my webpage where you can find all the commands that I'm going to use in this exact video. So if you take the first two commands and you of course uh, put them into your world and you activate them you will get a armor stand named green and an armor stand named red. Now these armor stands here uh, when we place them, they will be invisible because they already have some NBT tags already into the code. So basically, every time you want to have a red light, you place uh, an armor stand named red on the tree, like this. Voila! If we go in game mode 3, you can see that we have a small invisible armor stand. And it is going to generate these particles because I set up these two commands, which I'm going to show you guys later. Right, so we have now the particle. All we have to do, we can place a glass pane that is of the same color and voila it looks like a really nice decorative and a shiny Christmas light which I think it fits perfectly for Christmas trees and also to decorate the interior or exterior of your house but I want to tell you guys to don't exaggerate too much as I said in the other video with decorations because if you decorate something too much it, it doesn't look that good and now let's just alternate green and red let me first place Oops, the armor stands and uh, after I'm going to place down the, um, the glass panes. So let's place another red here, a green here, let's alternate, a red here, let's place another red here. That's it. We have everything done. Now let's place the glass panes and that's pretty much it. I mean, it's a really simple way to decorate your Christmas tree. It doesn't lag that much because the commands are really simple, um, just particles. But if you don't want to lag too much, just don't place too many of these uh, decorations. And look at that, look at how nice it looks, especially when it's uh, night outside. I mean, it's a really, really nice way to decorate Christmas trees in Minecraft. And this island looks wonderful, looks wonderful, guys. All right, comments, right, let's talk about comments. They are really simple slash execute comments. They are executing for the two different armor stands. One of them is named AS Green and the red one is named AS Red. So we are going to execute for this armor stand and we are generating some particles relative to those armor stands. For example, here, they are all red dust particles, but if we set some different values uh, here we can change the color of the particles and for the uh, red one we are going to generate red particles and that's pretty much it if you guys want to remove these armor stands type this command in chat kill at e name equals as red or as green if you want to remove the green ones and that's it I don't want to do it because I'm, I'll have to take a screenshot for the thumbnail and I don't want to place them back. So yeah, guys, that was it about today's creation. I really, really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did so, don't forget to drop a like button under this video and to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Also, make sure to click that bell near the subscribe button so you guys will be able to know when I publish a new video because YouTube is not sending the videos properly to everyone. So yeah, guys, I guess I'll see you all in my next video. See you. Bye.